Okay, well here's something uh, a little bit different, I haven't seen this before. Just thought I'd try getting a bit of a different perspective on the uh, filming from the 350QX. So, uh, what I sort of came up with is uh, wanting to film from about here. So we're filming from the back and uh, sort of see what he does in the air. Um, essentially what I've done is uh, use these uh, rods, which are just fiberglass rods, from my collective pitch heli training gear. This is a uh, distribution little plastic block and uh, here's the other one here. I basically uh, just drill through basically the uh, 350QX and uh, bolted that in there, shoved those little legs in there and uh, this one you can see leads all the way up, goes in that slot and this one is uh, basically a, just a little bit more of a stabilization rod just to uh, hold it around so it uh, doesn't go running away. So what it looks like from the side is there and the uh, little camera is going to be mounted up the top. So I've got this little, uh, this is a cam one and uh, it's got a little mount on the bottom which is very helpful and uh, we can just screw that onto there if I don't uh, break the whole assembly. Uh, it does go a little bit tail heavy, so if I let go of it, it uh, usually falls over, but now it's not. Well, I'll uh, take it out for a test fly, just in smart mode, just in case it's going to have some uh, funny flight characteristics, and we'll see what the view actually looks from like out there. Alright, here we go. Alright, so I'll prime the motors up and you can see it just uh, falls back at me. So when it lifts off, sort of tries to correct itself. And a uh, little bit of jello on there. Uh, doesn't fly too bad. Uh, it obviously wants to wag its tail around a little bit. Uh, it's just not used to the weight there. It's just uh, flight controller is not calibrated for it. Um, it's kind of interesting to see how it sort of flies. You uh, don't usually get that perspective, so it's uh, a little bit interesting. You can see what all the motors are doing and all that kind of stuff. Um, this is just our housing area. I'm lucky enough to have a small little reserve out the front of my house. So you can see there it's uh, trying to stabilize the hover in smart mode. It's uh, not very windy today, but uh, all the same, it's just not used to having all the weight back there. You can see when I bring the tail around, it's a little bit unstable and it uh, doesn't really know what to do. It's not too bad though. See here, I'll just do a bit of a low pass and uh, see what the perspective looks like. It's not too bad. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Doesn't really uh, pull up when you yank back on the stick. Uh, it uh, doesn't pitch and roll like it usually does. Uh, that's about all I really wanted to test with it, so I'll just uh, smoothly bring it down. Well, and there we go. Cheers, guys.